hello welcome to coffee j's class please if you are new to this channel or new in this class please subscribe and be part of this class and for my subscribers and those of me watching my videos thank you very much for always coming along let's keep on drawing without drawing there will be nothing on this planet Earth. in today's lesson we are going to draw an photographic projection photographic projection we are going to draw this figure is in isometric projection and we are going to draw this to um autographic projection so we are going to draw the plan the front view of the front elevation and the end view or the end elevation so this is the topic for today we are going to draw this figure in autographic projection let's look at uh our isometric drawing here now we know that this now the distance from here to this end is 40 millimeters and here to this side is 40 millimeters and the height that is from here to this side is 30 millimeters it's three centimeters and now the distance from here to here is 15 millimeters and here 15 millimeters so we are going to start by drawing our plan the plan of this figure so to draw the plan of this figure you consider the base so we have the distance from here to here, which is 40. So we are going to draw 40 by 40. And we are going to take our front view or the front elevation from this direction. So we are going to draw 40 by the 40. So we start by drawing our 40 by 40 or to draw our plan. So now with your compass or your divider, you measure 40 millimeters. You measure 40 millimeters. So you have uh, 40 millimeters. That is the from distance from here to this side because we are taking our uh, front elevation from this direction. So from distance from here to here is 40. So after drawing, after measuring your 40 millimeters, which is four centimeters, then uh, from here you mark your 40 millimeters here and we know the distance from here to this end is also 40 so you can use the same 40 millimeters from here and you mark your 40 millimeters good so now with your with your t square you draw your line then with your t square and your c square you draw your 40 millimeters to this end like this so we have this then we have this very simple have half more lessons on uh, autographic projection you can check you can go to the channel and I have some lessons so you can learn if today is your first time coming to this class you can get some of the lessons from the channel so this good so now as i told you before you can get the plan you have to consider this the, the, the size on or the shape of the of the base so we from our isometric drawing here we know the distance from here to here is 40 and from here to here is also 40 so it's you draw your 40 by 40 it goes like that so we have this now after drawing this then uh we consider the lines from the top so when we look at if we are taking the front view or the front elevation from this direction now from here we can see this first line which is this one and this to be the last one here so after drawing this then you measure the distance from here or the distance from here to this side which is 
20 millimeters so with your or with your divider or your compass you measure 20 millimeters so from the top this is what you will see all this this okay from the top this is what you will see you will see this side to be the plan you will see here and here so now after drawing the base then you measure 20 millimeters from here to here so with your compass you measure or your divider you measure 20 millimeters so we have our 20 millimeters so from here you mark then with your t square you draw this line good so now we have this to be the plan of this isometric drawing so as i told you when you look when you look from the top looking from the top this is what you see you are going to see two rectangles that is this area and this area so we have this and this here and here so this is the the plan of this isometric projection so now we are going to draw the front view or the front elevation now with your set square just extend this line up like this so for the the front view so we are going to see these two areas as the front elevation or the front view. So we are going to see this um, rectangle and this rectangle. So now when you look at this figure here, we have to consider the, the height that is the distance from here to here, which is 30 millimeters or is three centimeters so with your compass or your divider you measure 30 millimeters so we have our 30 millimeters then from here you mark a 30 then with your t square you draw your line The distance from here we are going to so when you look at this figure for the front view we are going to see these lines this line and this line this line is the same as this we're going to see this this and this we're going to see three lines now so now after drawing drawing this line measure the distance from here to here which is 15 millimeters and from here to here is also 15 millimeters so from here you measure 15 millimeters with your compass or your divider so with your 15 millimeters from here you mark your 15 then with your t square you draw another line Then with your set square, let's draw this as well. Then with your set square, move to this end. Now we have this to be the front view or the front 
elevation so when you look at this figure the front view from this direction you're going to see this rectangle and this so this is the front view now we are going to draw the end view or the end elevation and uh those who are here for the first time you can check my channel i have a lot of uh draw, um, photographic projections with this at this point with your 45 degrees set square and your t square you draw a line from this angle with your 45 degrees set square then you draw, you draw a faint line from here to this end now like this then from here as well then with your c square with your c square and your t square from here and draw a faint line in here as well at this point good then here as well just extend these lines it goes like this and here good so this is what we have today now at this point this is what we have and uh, we are going to draw the end view and we are drawing the uh, left uh the left side so we have our front view from this direction so we are taking our end view from here from the left but the left side of the isometric drawing here so we are going in there for the end view this is what we are going to see we are going to see this area we are going to see in this area and before you draw the end view you look at the plan uh look at the figure here and we know this area is here so we are going to get this part this end and this part is going to be this area so now you join this first you have to consider this the 40 millimeters and with this we have it here so just draw the base of the down here we have this good and we have the height which is from here to here to be 30 millimeters and we have this here so with your c square just draw your c square and your t square you just draw this line up to here good and look at this figure now we we have this the distance from here to here from the height it's here so with these lines you just draw a straight line from let's consider this for video with our t square let's draw this line the end view you first draw this with your t square so we have this So we move it then then with this you draw a straight line up to this line so from here to here then we consider this line and uh, use your t square to draw this line 
Then with your set spray, then your T square and your C square, draw this line. So we have our end view or our end elevation. So we have our plan or the top view, our front view or the front elevation and the end elevation or the end view. Guys, it's very simple. Take your drawing board, your, your drawing instruments and try this. Before you get the plan, you consider the, the, uh, the shape of the base. So we have the 40 by 40. So we have our 40 by 40. Then you consider the dimensions. Look at here. It says from here to here is 20 millimeters. Then you measure 20 millimeters. From here, you mark. Then you join this line. You extend these lines. Then the height, which is 30 millimeters. After getting the 30 millimeters, then the distance from, it says the distance from here to here is 15. So after getting the 30, you measure 15 millimeters. Then you draw this line. Then you extend all these lines to this side. Then with your 45 degrees set square, from here with your, with your T square and your 45 degrees set square, you draw this line, which is 40, 40 degrees here. A 40, sorry, 45 degrees set square. It's 45 degrees to this side. Then you extend these lines. Then it goes up with your T square and your C square. Then you look at the figure here. The distance from here to here is 30. So you join this 30. Then from here to here is 15. The lines are already there. So you join up to this end. Then you join the distance from here to here. Then you, you close this to get this to be the uh to get the end view or the end elevation. So this is very simple. Please take your drawing board, um your drawing uh instruments and try this. If you have any problem or any question, please you can always give your comment, give it, give your comment or ask your questions on the comment se session and uh I'm ready to answer all your questions. Thank you very much for coming along. As I always say, keep on drawing to keep the world moving. Without drawing, there will be nothing on this planet Earth. Thank you very much for coming along. I will see you in my next class. Thank you. This is Kofi Dress class. Bye.